Good afternoon. I'm really, really, really missing my camera lady right now. I wish my camera girl was here. Anyway, um, she picked up a deli container the other night. Let's see if this is more like what everybody's talking about. It um, doesn't really have any type of lip on it or anything. Um, if that's the container everybody's talking about, I know some of them have slots and things, but they're this thin type with no lid or no, no rim or lip as they call it. Some do, some don't, but uh, it won't make a difference. That's going to fit on there just perfect like that. Um, doesn't, if it has a rim, it's going to fit on there just perfect like that. Um, if it's a net pot, it's going to fit on there perfect. Um, this is made to fit on a lot of different things. It's one of those you get them from the hardware store for mixing paint in, for mixing up paint and stuff like that in. Um, same thing. It'll fit. So rim or not, it's going to fit. It'll adapt. It'll hang on to it just fine. Um, if not, that other type of clip will I know for sure. Anyway, I can show you real quick how to make this. And um, this one has a loop, but um, this one doesn't. This is straight, but um, if you just make the extension a little bit longer, you can put a loop into it. I showed that on another video. But um, let me show you real quick how to make one of these. I start with the same wire that, that I showed in the other videos, the acoustical ceiling wire. This is a piece about 30 inches long. I'll make sure I'm on camera here, sorry. This is a piece about 30 inches long. Um, dimensions aren't that important, except for a couple of spots, I'll show you. All right, you're gonna be bending a triangle here, so a little more than a 90 degree, all right. And I may have gone too far, no big deal. Anyway, you want to end up with that, okay? Not that hard. Easy, easy to do. Easy to do. You get you some wire and cut you some lengths of this. Once you figure out what lengths you want for what size hooks and everything, you sit down and put some music on one night or turn on your favorite show and get a pair of pliers or whatever and um, sit there and start making a few of these. In about 15, 20 minutes, you're going to have a pile of these made. And um, they will come in handy over the next month or two if you're repotting or moving plants or getting new plants around. All right, now we're at that stage, okay? Now I'm going to hold it. This is where you need to measure. And I'll show you how you can make a mistake. You don't want it where it's, the clip is way up on top like this because it'll wobble and won't have a lot of strain. You want to go down further with it where it's more stable. So, so it'll fit more than just one type of pot. Let's use this to measure with. I'll put my finger right here on the end. I'll take my index finger here and use it to mark it. I'll hold that and put a bend in it all the way, all the way across. So it comes down through it like that. And then you can snug that down a little bit. All right. So basically it's going to look like this. All right. And that's what you have so far. All right. Now at that point, Grab it on the end and bend it up. Move my thing up so I have a little more leverage. Keep going. All right. Now, the only other thing I'm going to do is you see the very end of this where it's flat. I'm going to grab it about halfway. Put a little kink in it like that. Okay. Helps it hold on to the contour of the pot better. Basically, it's done. That's it. There's your clip. <coughs> Excuse me. That's the clip. Okay? Just that simple. The first couple ones you make won't be perfect, but after two or three, they'll be fine. They hold on really well. I wouldn't hang a pot by this, but this is more for stabilizing a cane or a bulb or holding up a spike or something because you can bend it to whatever shape you want. You can put a ring on it, make them short, make them tall. Whatever you do, don't leave the end like this. Excuse me again. Make sure bend over that end. Make sure you put a safety tip on it so you don't hurt yourself. All right. So when you lean over your pots, you work with your pots. You don't poke yourself in the eye with that. That's bad enough, but the sharp end will really do some damage. All right. Anyway, it's very simple, very easy to make. All right. Just and they hold really, really well. I mean, they really. I can't even get that one off. There. Um, they hold really, really well. All right.
get some wire, give them a shot, a pair of pliers, about 30 inches long to start with. Um, 30 inch long one will make you long enough to make, 30 inches will give you long enough to make this. At that point, you can cut them down to whatever length you want or add 30 inches for a bigger loop or for more height or whatever, but 30 inches will make pretty much make this. All right. Plain and simple. Let me know if I can answer any more questions. Have a great afternoon.